This video is sponsored by Rizloan. Visit Rizloan.com to learn more. When engineers are designing the engine and fuel system, they expect the fuels being injected in the engine in precise droplet sizes. If the droplets change in size, it changes how the fuel burns in the engine. Larger droplets might not completely burn. Smaller droplets might burn too fast. This can increase emissions, set engine codes, and cause a check engine light to come on. So what changes the droplet size? It actually happens every time the engine is shut down. When the engine is shut off, the injectors undergo heat soak. Fuel residue evaporates in the injector nozzles, leaving a waxy olefin behind. Because the engine is off, there is no cooling airflow moving through the ports and no fuel flowing through the injector to cool or wash deposits away. So heat bakes the olefins into hard varnish deposits. Over time, these deposits can build up and clog the injector. A vehicle may have low mileage, but short drive cycles and increased heat soaks can clog the injector. Since the formation of these deposits is a normal consequence of engine operation, detergents are added to gasoline to help keep the injectors clean. But if a vehicle is used primarily for short trip driving, the deposits may build up faster than the detergents can wash them away. On four cylinder engines, the number two and number three injectors are in the hottest location and tend to clog up faster than the end injectors on cylinders number one and number four. The same applies to the injectors in the middle cylinders in six and eight cylinder engines. The hotter location, the more vulnerable the injector is to clogging from heat soak. Sometimes the detergents and pump gas need some help. Intake treatments can help to dissolve the deposits inside the injectors and restore the droplet size to what the engineers specifically had from the factory. These fuel treatments can also clean catalytic converters, intake valves, oxygen sensors, and carbon deposits left inside the combustion chamber. By doing this type of cleanup, it can reduce emissions, clear codes, and keep the check engine light out for your customers. I'm Joe Keen, and thanks for watching.